Hey friends, welcome to my kitchen here in Louisiana where I have a question for you today. What do you prefer to do when it comes to washing your dishes? Do you like to wash them by hand in the kitchen sink or do you prefer to use your dishwasher? We're going to talk about that. I'd love to know what you think works best for you and I'm going to share with you a surprising study about how hand washing can actually be good for your health. Can you believe it? Stick around and we'll learn about it next. Well, hello there. If we've not met before, my name is Angie. My husband, Bill, and I live here in Louisiana where we are trying to simplify a lot of things around our home and in our lives. So one of the things I want to talk about today was dishwashing. Maybe that has nothing to do with possessions, but it does have something to do with a simple way of living. Let me tell you about this interesting study that was done at the University of Florida. They took college students, divided them in half, asked half of them to wash the dishes. The main objective was just wash your dishes, get them clean, period. The other half they instructed on being mindful about the task as they were doing it. And by being mindful, I mean they talked about noticing the shapes of the dishes, noticing the feel of the sudsy water, the temperature of the water, the smell of the detergent, those type of things. Here is what they learned from this study. The group that was mindful about washing the dishes compared to the group that just took care of doing the dishes, no thought, thoughts about it. The mindful washers saw a 27% decrease in nervousness and a 25% increase in mental stimulation. And the study went on to say that those with overworked minds and those who are very stressed that hand washing dishes in a mindful way paying attention to the things that were discussed can actually be a form of therapy for you so what do you think about that look at this beautiful pottery you can use things like this and don't don't let them sit in your cabinet and it actually gives me joy to wash this by hand, feel of it, realize how much work um, that my friend put into this, and for me to take extra care to keep it clean. It just feels nice. Feel the suds, feel the warm water soft suds, the smell of the dish soap, pick one that you really like. I think you concentrate on um, sizes, shapes, feels, Just something to keep your mind occupied and not be thinking about the worries of the day. I made some bread earlier so I was using my mixer. piece to wash for sure. This is something I wouldn't put in the dishwasher anyway. Check this out. Isn't this fun? <laughs> this is fun just to have anyway. Check out. Check it out. <laughs> oh, it makes me laugh. Simple pleasures, right? Simple pleasures. What we got on vacation. Well, that's kind of neat to remember too. Maybe you can think about the time you had when you wash your coffee cup. Well, this just feels good to me. The, the feel of the sponge, the soft softness of the sponge, the warmth of the water, the sound of the water running. Some people say it takes more water to wash by hand. Some people say it takes less. I personally feel like it takes less. For Bill and I, there are just two of us, so we 
don't have that many dishes, so I know that's not going to be the same for everyone, and so I certainly can't speak for what works best for anyone else. But for us, we never even have this many dishes in the sink usually. We usually wash as we go so that we don't end up even hardly having to get out the dish drain. Normally we just stick things on the side mat because that's all we have is just a couple of things to wash. We wash as we go. I just let some of these things pile up today because I knew I was going to be doing this. Let me show you something else. Bill's daughter made this beautiful piece of pottery for me so that I could have a place to hide dish soap. So I normally keep this beside my sink with my sponge and my soap. A lot of times I just use um, the, the power wash and, and my hand even. You know, just feel it with your hands. show you my power wash. I don't like that ugly blue bottle with the label on it, so <laughs> I made this little cozy for my Dawn power wash. How silly is that? But I like it, so that's okay. Here's a tip for you if you happen to have a black porcelain sink. It took me forever to get the water stains off of this, but I did finally get it clean with a barkeeper's friend, so it might work for you. I also uh, crochet dishcloths that I use that are good for scrubbing and have a little bit of texture to them. And that's another texture to feel. So let me know what works for you. Are you a hand washer or a dishwasher user? Let me know what works best for you. Whatever is the most simple for you, that's the right thing for you. So, but leave me a comment below and let me know one way or the other. I would just really interested to see on how many people prefer one over the other. If you've had a little bit of fun with me just talking about washing dishes, how silly is that? But if you've enjoyed it, please give me a thumbs up. I would appreciate it. That helps me to grow my channel. And also, if you haven't subscribed already, I would love it if you would do that. That way we can see each other here again. So I'm going to show you my slice of simple. But before I do that, I'd just like to say, please remember, simple pleasures are the best. Keep it simple, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye. I'd like to know what you think, and I'm going to share some study. I'd love to know what works best for you, and I'm also going to share a surprising study about how dishes... <sighs> I'm going to show you my slice of simper and 
So, if you don't, if you have it, <sighs> hey, if you've actually found it fun to talk about washing dishes, please leave me a thumbs up. I'd appreciate that. And it, oh, there's a bug in my face. 